And today we're gonna do the basic position for a goalie. Paul, that is. Leia! Thomas! Loris, hi! <laughs> you know, for us it's good. <laughs> um, yeah, you see the balls over here. Okay. I'm starting the goal. Charlotte uh, is over there. Kuka, kuka, kuka. She's uh, taking a lesson uh, morning gymnastics. Where? You know, waking up, There's? waking up Holland. So uh, yeah, she's over there, spending a little uh, mother daughter time with her mother and her grandma and all her neighbors. Hey, Charlotte. Okay, uh, what we're going to do, uh, not only make it an exercise for me that is fun and exp to explain what my basic stance will be, but also to make it a fun video for you uh, and make it more match situation. You're gonna pass the ball towards me, I'm gonna pass it back to you. It can be a high ball from you, it can be a low ball, as long as it's a ball that I can pass back and then you take a shot at one time. Yeah. In between, I have to make sure that I'm back in my basic position and stay in that position before I can stop the ball. In the, in the game, I was always faster than that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, I didn't pay I didn't pay attention. I didn't pay okay. attention. What are we doing? After this, I will show you um, what my basic position is and where you have to focus on. And why it is so important, of course. Zullen we via links teruglopen? Ja, ja, ja. Oh. Oké, okay, okay. I'm awake now. Let's go. Bam! Bam! Kill the goalie! Oh, no. Ja, baseline challenge! Watch your other video. Hard time! Okay, now I want to explain you what my basic stance is. And of course when you want this to goalie, what you start with is your basic stance. And it happens when people are shooting from the top of the D in a match. But how many times in a match can you shoot from the top of the D without getting it out of the line as an attacker? How many times? Not so many times. No. And that's what we do right now. There's a ball, a shot, and I don't have to do anything. I'm already in my basic stance. Never happens. And that's why the first ball is to get me out of my basic, uh, basic stance and I have to get back at it. And that is what happens in a real match. Okay, what is my basic position? Um, start below and then work your way up. The feet, very important. I think when you have your toes to the front, you're the quickest to make a move sideways because you can put your weight on the entire foot. If you have it like this, your weight can only be on the front of your feet and you move a bit backwards. So actually you're standing like your toes this. Yeah, your toes to the front. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no. Yeah, it is good. I have my kickers on, so yeah, it's so hard to see. I'm not seeing it. So uh, yeah, it's hard to see. Yeah? No. <laughs> it's, it's a good thing because a lot of goalies think you have to have your heel off the ground, but, but you don't have to, because this isn't, is this comfortable? No. No. And you have to have a basic position, which you can have for at least five minutes. Okay. Then it's comfortable. So I'm, I'm still standing on my heel. Yeah, I right. still st have my heel on the ground, Let's try but my weight is on the front. And that's something different. <laughs> and now we like you're on the, in the back. You're like you're on a French okay, toilet. It's like a little small <laughs> middle so I'm, I'm moving in the front, yeah? Yeah. 
you have to have your balance on the front of your feet. Okay. And you do that by having uh, your knees above your toes. Yeah. So a bit bent forward. Yeah. And your shoulders above your knees and toes. So you move a bit forward. Yeah? yeah. And then automatically your balance on the, is on the front of your feet. Okay. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. But what you do now is that you make a, lo a big uh, angle over here as well. So you can move a bit up. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but still have your balance forward. And this is important. Yeah. Alright. Yeah. Okay. Um, about the hands. It's very important. And everyone has his favorite. Some goalies are like this, some goalies are more like this. I don't really care as long as there are a couple of things that are important. Your elbows need to be off your body. Sideways but also front. And this is front but it's a, lo a lot to the front. And there's tension on your shoulders and you don't want tension on your shoulders. It has to be relaxed. Because when there's tension over here, it goes to your entire body and everything is in tension. <laughs> so relax a bit more. Have your shoulders relaxed. Uh, and then there's one thing, so that elbows are important, but your hands, like this, has to be open. Yeah? You have to show the attacker the inside of your hands and your stick. So the brand of your stick. Because you stop the balls over here, over here, over here, and then this side the same. But if you have your hands like this, maybe it feels more comfortable, but then you first have to open up before you go to the ball, and that takes time. Yeah? yeah? So the elbows in front of you are important for the balance. The hands a bit open are important to get faster towards the ball. And then there's a last thing that is very important, and that is your eyes. Your eyes always need to be on the ball. There's only one ball in play, and you have to have your eyes on the ball, and that's it. Okay. Let's go again. Okay. Out of the line. Yeah. yeah. I missed you guys. Uh, He's got new gear. Feels so sexy right now. <laughs> What you see now, and this is more match-like, not that you play a ball against a goalie, but often where a goalie is in trouble is because they have to move a lot or they stop a first shot or are out of balance and then have to save a second shot. And that's the most difficult thing, because that basic position is there, we thought about it. It's the most easy way to stop a ball, to stop every ball, the biggest chance of stopping a ball. And the more you're out of that basic position, out of balance, the harder it gets to stop a ball. There was one, a ball over here, I leaned back a bit to my left, impossible to stop it over there. So balance is also a very important thing in your body position. Your feet 
both feet has to have the same weight on it. So that means balance. Is it something you have to keep in mind or always focus on when you're moving? Always, oh, yeah, okay. always. When a stick is going back, and that was I was focusing on, when a stick is going backwards, on the moment the stick is going backwards, yeah. standing still, balance, hands in front of you. But the tip is that you're already in position then, right? Yeah, Before already. It, yeah, okay. Yeah, but good thing, um, it's more important to stand in balance and in base position than be in the perfect position. Okay, so balance is important. Balance is most important. Because when I'm somewhere in the left of my goal, over here, and my paper position will be over here when it's a shot from the top of the. But I'm over here, I can move over here on the moment the shot is taken, but when the ball goes over there, I'm gone. When I stand still over here, I can move to my left and to my right. Yes, this will be more difficult, but still I have a bigger surface of stopping. I can reach more balls. Mm. Yeah, probably the ball will go there, but I can go there. It's a bit more difficult. But when I move here, this is I can do it. I'm not like Mario. <laughs> <laughs> when I move to the right, I can only move to the right or it takes a second before I can move to the left again. So and that, that time you don't have. So standing still in balance is more important than reaching the perfect position in front of your goal. It's right. a bit uh, like uh, life, you know. Balance in your life is really important. Ah, and a goal in your life reaching is also your really important. Reaching your goal in life is not important at all. Have balance <laughs> in your life. You should, never, you should oh, yeah. never reach your goal in life. Just stay in balance. That's oh, it. Stay in balance. <laughs> okay. Okay. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, if you did, please like it and subscribe our uh, video channel. And also, if you have any questions or uh, remarks or something, please let us know in the comments. And also follow us, of course, on Instagram, Facebook. Twitter. <laughs> okay, thank, thank you for watching.